I couldn't go into summer without showing you all this Chinese favorite. And it's a cooling mung bean jelly noodle topped with a spicy, savory sauce. And no doubt you guys will all enjoy it. I have two cups of water coming to a boil and in this bowl, I have a half a cup of mung bean starch. You guys have to get it. I will provide a link down below. It has this kind of wonderful sweet taste um, and the texture is amazing. So half a cup of mung bean starch with one cup of water and I'm just mixing it until it's smooth before adding it to the water mixture. I'm cutting it a little bit close here, but uh, this pot is right over about medium to medium high heat. And I want to bring this mixture to a boil while scraping the sides constantly, just to make sure that nothing burns. And the goal is to get this into a translucent stage. So that means that the starch does need to be cooked off. And once it starts getting clear and the bubbles start forming, then I know we're good. The mixture will fit about two of these containers. So after it cools down, just stick it into the refrigerator until it firms up. Now you don't need to use a mortar and pestle, just chop everything pretty finely. Um, I'm gonna start off by putting in a little bit of fermented black beans and that just has like a rich kind of nice salty flavor and I'll put all of the amounts down below in the description box. Um, there's gonna be peanuts, there's gonna be garlic, uh, sugar, soy sauce. This is going to be a little bit of um, chili oil. And then finally, one teaspoon of sesame oil and just mix all of that together. Break open all of those items so that the flavors mesh and blend in.
it is such a cool recipe in the literal sense. The jelly just cools you down in the summertime and then you have that savory kind of spicy but crunchy sauce up on top. It is so unique but it is so good, especially for the summer months. Anyways, I hope you all have enjoyed this recipe and please do try to make it. As usual, if you wanna see more recipes like this, please remember to hit that like and subscribe button and I will see you guys all again real soon. Bye.